Hello, Scott Hawkinson here, Stewardship Director for the Iowa Missouri Conference, and I want to share a stewardship nugget. I'm here at the Iowa Missouri Conference office, right by the entrance to the building, standing not too far away from the Treasury Department. And this is where the tithe dollars and other offerings, many offerings, come from your local church. I would like to talk for a few minutes about the flow of money in the Adventist church. There's a time in most church services that an offering plate gets passed to you and to others. When you put money in it, what happens to those hard-earned dollars? Well, it goes right where you marked it to go on the tithe envelope or whatever it was announced that the loose or unmarked offering would go to. What you generously give to the local church budget or specific local church ministries will stay in that account. The rest of your offerings are passed on to designated ministries outside of your local church. The tithe is passed on to the Iowa Missouri Conference. What happens to the tithe dollars that are sent to the conference? Well, it goes to support God's work all around the world. The Seventh Day Adventist Church is a worldwide church with a mission to bring the gospel to the entire world. There are many unentered areas that need the gospel preached to them. There are people in our own country, our own state, and our own cities that still need to be reached. Your tithe dollars help make this possible. Here's a breakdown of where it goes. The conference keeps 65% of it for ministries within our own conference. 9% is sent to the Mid-America Union. 11% is sent to the North America Division to fund the pension program so that our retired pastors can receive income and 15% is sent to the North America Division of the General Conference. Yes, the North America Division is part of the General Conference, so some of the money sent to the North America Division of the General Conference is used in North America, and some is used to support ministry all around the world. A portion is kept for use in North America and comes back to the Iowa Missouri Conference to help with education and evangelism. Now the Iowa Missouri Conference wants to spread the gospel all around Iowa and Missouri. This is done through tithe dollars used in many ways. Let me share those ways. First, pastors are hired to do evangelistic work and provide spiritual leadership to the churches. And a portion of the tithe dollars are used to subsidize teacher salaries in elementary education to provide important Christian education to our children in a world that is daily throwing unbiblical ideas in their faces. Sunnydale Academy receives some of the dollars to provide a Christian education and train young people to take up the mission of taking the gospel to our world. Camp Heritage Summer Camp has been ministering to over 500 children each summer with encouragement to make decisions for Christ. Pathfinders and Adventures provide a great program for young people to learn about God's world, have innocent, healthy fun, and grow in Christ. Women's Ministries encourages the women in our conference to grow spiritually and make a difference in their world and their family through women's retreats and other events. The Communication Department reports what is happening in our conference so that we are aware and encouraged by what God has done in our field. The Bangabook Book Ministry helps students take God's message door to door and provide great scholarships for students attending Adventist schools. As you can see, the money you put in the offering place supports a lot of ministries in a lot of places. The more that we give in tithes and offerings, the more funds are available for God's work to get done in your local area and beyond. Let's be generous with the time, treasure, and talent that God has given us. Remember, freely you have received, freely give.